Hello everyone, in this video we are going to show you the different ways of measuring a pupillary distance. The PD or the pupillary distance is defined as the distance between the center of the pupil in millimeters. This measurement ensures that the prescription lenses are correctly centered in front of your eyes when purchasing new glasses. There are two types of PD measurement, one for distance and one for reading. The distance PD measurement is used for distance, intermediate, very focal or bifocal glasses. The PD ruler is designed to fit over the bridge of your nose with the section cut out for your eyes to look through it. The distance PD can be measured monocularly and binocularly. For measuring monocular pupillary distance, the following procedures must be followed. Measuring distance PD with the help of the examiner sitting opposite to each other at arm's length, the examiner should hold the PD ruler between their thumb and forefinger, resting the ruler at zero on the bridge of your nose and steady their hands by placing their remaining fingers against your head. The person taking the measurement should close their right eye and look directly opposite into the patient's right eye. Make sure the patient looks directly into the examiner's open eye as the patient is being measured. Make a mental note of the measurement from the center of the bridge of the nose to the center of the pupil in millimeters. Without moving the PD ruler, the examiner taking the measurement should switch their open eye, closing their left eye and using their open right eye to look into the patient's left eye directly opposite. Again, make sure the patient looks directly into the examiner's open eye as the patient is being measured. Make a mental note of the second measurement from the center of the bridge of the nose to the center of the pupil in millimeters. Now add these two numbers together to get the patient's pupillary distance measurement. The examiner should repeat this process several times after which the average will be taken. In general, an adult pupillary distance measurement will fall somewhere between 55 and 72 millimeters. If the examiner do not have a PD ruler, he or she can use a standard ruler with millimeter measurements. For measuring binocular pupillary distance, the following procedures are followed. Measuring pupillary distance using corneal reflection. Here, the examiner holds a pen light directly below his or her eye and shines it into the eye of the patient. The patient looks either at the pen light or the examiner's eye. The reflection of the pen light on the cornea is used as the reference point. Measure the reflection of the light from one pupil to the other. Repeat this process for 3-4 to four times after which the average is taken and the measurement is noted. Measuring pupillary distance using a spectacle. Another way by which we can measure the binocular BT is by using a spectacle. Here, the patient is asked to wear a spectacle and the examiner closing his or her right eye asks the patient to look into his or her left eye. With the help of a marker, the examiner marks the center of the pupil of the patient's right eye. Now the examiner closes his or her left eye and asks the patient to look into his or her open right eye. Again, with the help of a marker, the examiner marks the center of the pupil of the patient's left eye. Now take the spectacle off and measure the distance between the two points in millimeters. This is the required pupillary distance of the patient. Measuring near PT. While measuring the near PT, the patient should focus on an object close to their face. Hold the pen around 30 cm directly in front of their face and keep their focus on the pen while the pupillary distance is being measured. The examiner will note the measurement from the center of one pupil to the other. Lastly, thank you for watching this video.